we have seen how to add and how to subtract decimal numbers so let's see here how to do some word problems for addition and subtraction the first problem is this rahul cycled 1.85 km from his house to the library 0.535 km from the library to the post office and 2.7 km from the post office to his house what is the total distance rahul cycled the first thing we will do is let's write down all these distances one after the other the first distance is to the library and it is 1.85 the second one is to the post office which is 0.535 and the third distance is back to his house which is 2.7 km all the distances are in km so i am not explicitly writing here as km now if you carefully look at the problem you can see that it says this distance and that distance so the word there is and and at another place where i have underlined the comma the comma also means and here whenever you see a problem where they say this and that and that that means they are indicating addition instead of this problem if the problem had said that i spent this much money here and that much there and that much there how much i totally spent then again it would be a problem of addition here also you can see the word and and in the end it says what is the total distance so whenever you see the word total that means you have to put together or group together and putting together means addition so let's add these three decimal numbers you can see that we have written the decimal numbers exactly below one another all the decimal points are aligned and i have put some extra zeros to adjust the lengths so let's add 0 plus 5 plus 0 equals 5 5 plus 3 equals 8 8 plus 5 is 13 plus 7 is 20 so we write down 0 and carry over 2 2 plus 1 plus 2 equals 5 so the sum is 5.085 or 5 and 85 thousands that means the total distance that rahul cycled is 5.085 km or 5 and 85 thousands km let's look at the next example a rope is 2.3 meter long if 0.75 meter of the rope is cut how much rope is left again let's write down the lengths one after the other the first is the length of the rope the initial length is 2.3 the part that is cut is 0.75 now look at the words i have underlined cut and left whenever uh, the problem says that something is cut or something is given away or something is used up or something is spent that means they are indicating subtraction and the answer would be always what is left with you or what is remaining now instead of this problem if the problem was something like this that a can holds some amount of water and some amount of i mean some xyz amount of water is used up how much water is left what would you do again you will do subtraction because used up means subtract what is left means the answer of the subtraction when the problem says that i got this and this and that what do i get together that is addition when the problem says when i have used up when i have spent when it is given away 
that means subtraction so let's do the subtraction here again the decimal points are lined up i have put an extra zero in the first decimal number to adjust the length so let's subtract 0 minus 5 in this case 0 is smaller than 5 so let's borrow from the next column 3 becomes 2 and 0 becomes 10 10 minus 5 is 5 again 7 is bigger than 2 so let's borrow from the next column the 2 here becomes 1 and the previous 2 becomes 12 so 12 minus 7 equals 5 and 1 minus 0 equals 1. So the answer is 1.55 or 1 and 55 hundredths. So the part which is left with us, the part of the rope is 1.55 meter.